Former Vice President Joe Biden will not be accepting the Democratic presidential nomination for president in Wisconsin. DNC Chair Tom Perez said no convention speakers will travel to Milwaukee and that we put the health and safety of the American people first. We followed the science, listened to doctors and public health experts, and we continued making adjustments to our plans in order to protect lives. The announcement is a major blow to Milwaukee, which still had hopes of hosting some sort of convention. Now the four-day event will be all virtual. Capitol Bureau Chief Emily Fannin has you covered on how Milwaukee officials are reacting and whether or not this could impact Biden's chances in the state. Emily? Amber, there were high hopes from elected officials that the former Vice President Joe Biden would make his first visit to Wisconsin this year to accept the Democratic nomination. Milwaukee's Mayor Tom Barrett called it a devastating loss, but added it's a wise health decision as the coronavirus wears on the community and across the state. Now the event will look pretty uneventful on the grounds as the four-day convention moves to an all-virtual one. Many hope Biden coming to the state would help give Democrats a boost as the 2020 election shapes up and with the goal of winning back the state this year. Mayor Barrett and other Democrats said this decision shows Biden and the party are taking the virus seriously compared to President Trump. As disappointed as I am that we can't show off the city, our priorities have to be on helping people get their lives back in order. And that means working our way through the COVID-19 crisis, dealing with the economic fallout that's resulted from it. This announcement also ignited more calls for Democrats to allow the state to host the DNC again in 2024. But Mayor Barrett said he's focused on this year and still making the most of it.